Happy hearties! A very good evening to you and a very warm welcome to our Friday night internet phone-in. Tremendous stuff. I can't believe it. Friday night already and here we are on the phone-in. Tremendous. Nothing gets past me, I say. And a big, big dinky do to you. Fantastic. Now then, welcome, welcome, welcome. We are live on YouTube. We are live on Facebook Live. And we are live on TikTok just for you. Good evening, Scotty. Good evening, William. How lovely to have you with us. And welcome, 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 I say. Who's that? You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who is that? Hello? Can you hear me? Wait, do we just see what's happening here? Good evening, Dinky Doo. You're live on Scotty's phone in. Hello? It's me, Glenn. Glenn, how are you, love? You were quick tonight. Yeah, yeah. To you guys earlier, Scotty. You've what, La? Good win for you guys earlier against Moldova. Oh, yes, excellent stuff. Yeah. The football, I saw we had football on yeah, tonight. The only trouble is it interferes with the soap operas. And you won so well here against Moldova, Scotty. Yes, yes, well, we've done all right, haven't we, love? We're winning 5 0 at minute. Hey, you're some man, aren't you? Yeah, it's, it's good stuff anyway, Scotty, isn't it? Well, I'll but, tell you, Glenn, I'm not too bothered about it because we're having the Scotty McClure phone in anyway. The, the Tartan Army will be up and running for World Cup, Scotty, won't you? Tartan Army up and running. That's what it's all about, I say. And dinky Definitely, do. Yeah. <laughs> so what you been up are you, are you doing then, Scotty? Oh, we're great. We're very, very, very busy and a wonderful podcast tonight. So you'll be I hearing thought, that in public in the future. Scotty, I thought I'd break Martin's winning streak. Of four, is it four, uh, four days? Four, like four in a row Martin's had, absolutely. The old winning runs have to come to an end, don't they, Scotty? Well, this is it. You know, you can't win all the time, can you? You've got to let somebody else get the first call in. That There's guy. the lovely Cahitian and Nugget. Dinky do, oh. Scotty. Hello, pal, yeah. says Thomas. It's, Hello, well, Thomas. Well, like well, lottery numbers, you, you sometimes win. I mean, you know. Yeah. I remember going into work. I said, they said, are you all right? He said, I said, hi, I've just won lottery. They went, you're joking. I said, no, yeah. no, no, I have, I have. And they went, oh, my God, how much? I said, uh, £3.20. <laughs> they weren't too chuffed, oh you know. Oh, they said, is this a joke, Scott? Stop mocking about. Seriously, <laughs> I'm telling truth. And what about this one? There's Rattle says, are you Irish babes? No babes, but everybody's Irish to a greater or lesser extent. There's Scotland and Ireland, but all Celts, though, aren't they, Scotty? Well, of course, oh, I mean, absolutely. Right. And a lot of England as well, really. Definitely, yeah. The Angles and the Saxons, the Northumbrians, the Yorkshire people, you know. 100%. So there shouldn't be no discrimination against different... There should uh, never, uh, ever be discrimination, uh, Glenn. I don't know what people are playing at. There shouldn't be, Scotty, should they? Just no. There? You never, ever need discrimination, Glenn. When, when you've got other countries and other towns or cities going... Surely you're not from there. They're, they're, they're despicable and all. Yeah. Well, they don't know it, do they? Do you, do you know, I, don't, I don't get it. Do you? I don't get why they are. I, I don't get why they are. Hey, Glenn, bit of chat for you. Frank says, morning, Scotty Dinky Doo from Australia. So they're listening oh, yeah. to you in Australia. Good evening, Susan okay. Jerry D from Martin. Uh, how's the first lord of the internet, says Frank? Hi, Scotty Martin, Emma, Suzanne. I won £100 on a scratch card the other week. Says Suzanne. Well done, Suzanne. So that's good, the isn't it? The Australians' rivals is uh, New Zealand, aren't this guy? You know, the uh, Aborigines and all them. Yes. Because they were the founders. Though. They were the original ones. They though, were the like, founding the natives, fathers. Yeah. You're quite right. Correct, yeah. Absolutely. And Scotty knows, they, says Luke. You've also got a rivalry between America and Canada, aren't you? Little bit of rivalry there. You've got that. North America, South America. Definitely. New yeah. York and Washington. Glasgow and Edinburgh. Rangers yeah. and Celtic. The Owls. Yeah, well, the yeah, Owls. And the Blades. Yeah, the Owls and the Blades. Barnsley. Barnsley. Barnsley, the Owls and the Blades. Barnsley. Rotherham. Yeah, Liverpool and Everton. 
Manchester United, Manchester City. Manchester United, Manchester, Aston Villa, Birmingham City. Yeah, definitely. Wolves, West Brom. Yeah, the Wolves, West Brom. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, what about uh, what about Spurs and Arsenal? It's Arsenal, yeah. Yeah, the Gunners. Chelsea, Chelsea and West Ham. Chelsea and West Ham. Yes. What about what's the other one that uh, they're always shouting about? Dan, don't say now till I see if I can get it. Uh, so you've got Chelsea and you've got West Ham, and then Millwall. Millwall, oh yeah, I don't get. They've got a bit of a. They've got a problem, aren't they? Millwall. They've got a bit of. They've got a bit of a reputation. It's got to them, them people, their fans sometimes. Cause, what know, about this guy? Croc says was wondering where all the pies went. Here lies the explanation. What? Got to the, this like crews, you know, like gangs. Within football, you know, before football kicks off, one or two, I'm not into that kind of thing. Well, there shouldn't be any gangs at and, all. Uh, they all get together. They've, they've even made their own books, Scotty. To be fair, yeah, there should only be there should only be one gathering of people, and that's Scotty McClue fans. You shouldn't need to have any ambiance no. in football outside of football, should you? Or no, any, absolutely. Any I think I'm just wondering if they should chuck football. Scotty, that'd be a bit controversial. Well, like I that. don't know. You Scotty, see, maybe we could do other things. Scotty footballs as a football. Fan, no, I don't think so. I was watching. I, I was watching at the bus stop yesterday morning. Right, everybody on the phones. Now, had that been Sheffield twenty years ago, they'd all been cracking yeah. on. Hey, all right, lovely. All right. Oh, our bus doesn't come, is it? Right, all yeah. that stuff. Not a word. All on the yeah. phones. Now, I'm right. thinking. Instead of going to football matches, would they not yeah. be better just sitting in the house on the phone? There's Holmey yeah. saying up the Royal Artillery. Uh, Scotty, I, Scotty, I don't think someone will answer as a big, you know, from the business perspective, yeah. you know, with football being so expensive what it is. But why don't we just watch on his phones? I think... Why I don't you pay so someone like, that. I don't know, 25p and watch the game on your phone? Exactly. You know, that would be it, wouldn't it? Just for like a subscription and, and whatever, Scotty. Yeah. yeah, but not too much. 25p, not like 25, 50 quid. You know the prices anyway, Scotty, what they charge to watch it on TV. You know, yeah, forget all I that, mean, though. 25p, see the game. Can you imagine that? Yes. May I have been, I've been said that, though, Scotty? It does make sense because if people, are, if companies are putting prices up so much to watch it, you're going to lose customers. Cause well, of course you are. Nobody's yeah. going to start watching it. Do you know what I mean? So no, there's no point. No, no. Evening, Scotty, from the port of Cadiz on the way to no, Las Palmas. What about that, Glenn? Brilliant. So for the, quant for the quantity of price, what they're charging, reduce it to a reasonable price. Then Get it down. 25p a game for everyone. Lower, lower it, exactly. They'd be coining it in. Coining it in. I'm saying we concerts as well, Scotty. Do the same way, everything. Yeah, I mean, Scotty McClue's absolutely free. Everybody comes and joins us. If somebody wants to stick a quid into PayPal.me forward slash Scotty McClue, no problem. Then you're grateful for it, aren't you? Yeah, very that. grateful. Lovely. Thank you very much for that. Jobs are good in Scotty, innit? Jobs are good in love. So there were James Gibb wants to know if Dinky Doo Lord yeah. McClue likes you know, trifle or cake. Do you, do you remember when uh, All in Road Scotty in Sheffield? Yep. Uh, before Super Tram got built. Yep. I, I've I've looked at one or two things on you know archives from eighties. Yeah. It's just it's just mesmerising, Scotty. You know the old buses and the, the old. Fantastic. Uh, yeah, the old and a lot of them single deckers as well. Definitely, and you've got that bendy bus. Yeah, kind of Yorkshire likes his well. single deckers. You see, some of the old Sheffield streets are a bit narrow down at the old yeah, engineering yeah. bit. You know. Mm. Hey, what about this? Here's Tom from Barnsley, right? How's Bobby Brown pants, Scotty? Do you remember that? I do, Scotty, yeah. Bobby Brown yeah. pants, and I had lunch one day with a policeman. He says, you yeah. tell Bobby Brown pants, Bobby Black pants will be off with him. <laughs> Great stuff. Scotty, uh, do you have a lot of double-deckers in Scotland, though? Right? Oh, yeah, we've got the deckers up here because we've got a lot of space, you know what I mean? Yeah, we See, the other thing you've got in Sheffield is the trees. Yeah, definitely. So yeah. your double-deckers are going to be pushing the trees a bit, you know? You need single-deckers now, really, don't you, to be fair? Well, you heard me story, didn't you? You heard me story. You heard me story. Well, the other thing is you've got a lot of railway bridges. You have, yeah. 
you know, and you have but, to watch the deckers on the railway bridges. There, there is a lot of railways, uh, bridges that are being, that don't actually have trains going on now, you know, the old industrial ones. Well, that's it. I remember getting a toot out Peniston Way from uh, an international lorry driver. Yeah. Yeah, you don't get them now with this Brexit, so they're short of drivers, but he'd come that from Europe. Sure. He goes toot toot and points, and I said, "Yeah, on you come," and that was it. He that's wasn't what, sure at bridge. That's what's lost its um, its status, really, to be fair. Scott, it hasn't it? it? It's lost its culture, hasn't it? I, I think not only Sheffield, a lot of cities and towns, though, to be fair, and it's. I, I don't like the old style stuff. Oh, of you course know? you do. I, I wasn't it nice to go into the station and fires on. Yeah, exactly. But now, now you're seeing these big glorified stations now well yeah you they don't, don't want it you see because of global warming you don't recognize them for what they are here really no to used fair. to go into the station do you remember the gas lamps yeah i do yeah yeah hey glenn bit of advice here here's ronnie shaw i'm watching yeah. england versus albania england five albania zero at 63 minutes yeah that's correct yeah is that right is that good stuff that's got to Telephone boxes, the old telephone boxes. Ah, the old red, red boxes. Red you don't see many of them. Don't see so many. There's very few boxes. I think somebody told me there's only 26,000 phone boxes left. Nice. Okay. When you used to put 60, you used to put 60 pence into the phone boxes, you could talk for like 15 minutes. Yeah, that's it. You could put it out. Hey, you'll be too young to remember trunks, please. You uh, went in uh, and there were just a phone. And you picked oh, yeah. it up and it buzzed and said, Operator, can I help you? You said, Ah, yeah. trunks, please. They said, Yeah, where to? You said, Can I get a call from uh, Sheffield in Yorkshire to uh, oh, yeah. Glasgow in Scotland? Said, Yeah, mm -hmm. can, can you put two anthropins in the box, please? Oh, uh, yeah. Right. So you then went, One, two, with your shillings. And then you yeah. went, One, two, three pennies. They went, Thank you. Go ahead, please. And you gave it, hey, oh, Glenn, how are you? It's me. I'll, I'll not be a minute. Yeah. <laughs> and, and now you've got telephones connect to internet. Oh, uh, you've got the lot. You can charge your parts. You can even charge your phone while you're outside. What are we doing right now? It's just amazing. Glenn, I'm going to have to dash. They're all going absolutely berserk. Enjoy, Scotty, anyway. Listen, you have a great night. And you'll cheer, Scotty. Think you do, la. All the best. You Fantastic. Scott, Quality. Quality chat, I'll see the love. There we are. That's our Glenn. What a great guy. Now, uh, Keith Sneddon has just sent me five pounds. Uh, Sheba Dog laughing slightly while blushing and covering his mouth with one arm. Keith, thank you so much for that. You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hello, you're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hey, Scotty, it's uh, Phil Doherty from the comments. Ah, oh, Phil, how lovely to have you with us. You're not just from comments now, you're from Funny. Well, uh, well, it's my birthday today, so I was wondering if you could uh, give me a special shout-out, please, if that's okay. What what day is it today? It's, it's my birthday today. Ah, oh, happy birthday, La, fantastic. We won't ask you what age. Well, I can say it. I'm 34. <laughs> 34. That's wonderful, yeah. that is. Yeah, I, uh, I can't. I, I'm not going to go into it too much, but I can't comment uh, for some reason because I've, I've, I've got a ban uh, for like seven days, uh, you know, because I, I don't know why, really, because I had a bit of a disagreement with somebody. And that. Well, listen, you should be able to do that. I take it without, without saying the name. I take it you're talking about a social media platform. Yeah, I was on there and I had, a, I had a disagreement with somebody and, you know, and then I guess that community standard thing flagged up and it said, you know, you can't Yeah, they comment. say that, but I, I don't know, you know. I mean, I, I think some of the stuff's a bit questionable on there. I wouldn't worry yeah, about I, it, La. I mean, it, you know, my, uh, you know, it wasn't anything terrible. It was just no, I know, it doesn't need to be. I mean, I, I, re I remember getting a day's ban for calling somebody a green-eyed monster. Uh, so come on, uh, you know, I mean, what's not community about that, you know? Happy birthday, says Ronnie. Give Scotty a talk show. I'd so watch, says Brett. Dinky-doo, oh. ladies and gents, says Gavin Superman. Dinky-doo. 
And what well, about five pounds from Keith Sneddon? Is that not beautiful? Uh, thank you. Appreciate that, everyone. Uh, unfortunately, I'm watching loving the show uh, tonight. Also, I'm not very well because I've been thrown up for a couple of days as well. So, oh, I'm sorry yeah. to hear that, love. You, yeah, you need to get your strength up. Hang on two okay. seconds. Hang on two seconds, La. I'm going to have to say goodbye to the TikTokers and get them back. We've got a problem with the uh, connection, so I'm going to get them back. There we are. These things happen. Right, so that's that. So they've gone. So we're going to get them back now. There we go. Beautiful. Right, and uh, how do we get this? Oh, there we are. Right. Sorry about that. So I guess what's on my mind tonight as I turn 34, I know it's not old, but my mum's like 69. She told me, do you know, when you get to my age, you'll feel old. But I guess I guess now that I'm 34, and I know people are saying my baby and that, but I guess, do you know, with yourself, or do other people feel sometimes like, where's all the time going? Well, no, I was what thinking was today, on? wait till I tell you this, right? You'll love yeah. this one. Uh, I was looking at, now, what was I looking at today? Was it a shop? Hang on a sec. Yes. I have had, because we've got this COP26 uh, in Glasgow, yeah. they've closed a lot of the main roads. Yeah. So what you've got to do is take these alternative routes. So I went on a route today. I hadn't been on for some time, according to me, right? Yeah, I, I actually walked out. I thought, hey, that used to be a car dealer's there. I remember it well. And I could yeah, even I remember their sign. Do you know how long ago that was? Oh, I have no idea. 60 years. Wow. I was five years old. Wow. Do, do, do you know, some, you know, sometimes I watch films or I read something or I read somebody that's inspirational and or you know, get something from a film or record. Or, or watch, watch I, something I, I, that's inspirational you know, I don't film. Know where all the time's gone sometimes. Like time just. Oh, you know, the time just flies. A lifetime is just a grain yeah. of sand, a I, flutter. I mean, you've got to take all these, uh, all these moments of uh, joy and. You know, yes, like, yes, like, yes. That's joy. what it's all about. Yeah, and. I guess that was just on my mind tonight. I just wanted to... Uh, no, that's beautiful, that. We love it. Well, um, I'll uh, let somebody else get on, but um, I'm glad I got on with you tonight, and God no. bless everybody. And Phil, everybody it's just so there. lovely to time. hear from you. And remember, you're not just from chat, you're you. Uh, thank you. Good night. Lovely night. Night, night, la. All the best. What a fine fellow. My goodness me, amazing. Send three and four pins. We're going to a dance, says Ronnie. Yes, the whispers from World War One. Give Scotty a talk show, says everybody. Dinky do TikTokers. Dinky do Ronnie. Thank you so much. We had a job with the TikTok. It's back now, guys. If anybody's been wondering, that COP26 was a farce, says Gavin. Yes. Now then, who's this? Hello, you're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Can you hear us? Hello, can you hear me? Hello, you're live on Scotty's phone in. Hello, Scotty, my man. It's Martin. How are you Martin, doing? my man. How are you, Lala? How are you doing, Lala? I'm doing very, very well, son. How's your night been? Been great, great. Been absolutely well. great, son. Fantastic night. We had a problem there with the TikTok, but it's back now. Do you know what I love? I love mint pies and whipped cream. Wow. Oh, stop. Can you be that? Trust me. Stop. I, I, I haven't had my supper yet. Basically, every Christmas Eve, I always put a cookie and a glass of milk for Santa Claus every year. A glass of milk and a cookie. I love it, Martin. Well done. Yes. So... Um, do you think Matey Boy might come on tonight? Matey Boy might come out tonight. Martin, I can't predict who's coming on. I know, I know, I know. Do you know what I'm saying? I mean, that's I can't predict who's coming on, Martin. How often does TikTok crash a lot? Does, does it, it doesn't off? very. It doesn't very often. Tonight, maybe with just it was the internet connection. I don't think it's anything to do with TikTok. 
know, I know. It's very good. I mean, sometimes, obviously, all networks can have outages, you know. Uh -huh. But no, it's very good. I am very, very, very impressed with TikTok. I know, but I am. And I am, you know, I would like Martin, and you can help me here because you can share it. I want tonight, by the end of the show, 3,000 subscribers on YouTube. Yes. Now, there's no reason not to have Martin. There's no reason for this one or two subscribers. 3,000. We need about another 15. Okay. Now, if we can't find 15 subscribers to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel, what kind of people are we? I know. You know what I'm saying? Sign, sign the petition and get, get, get other people coming into um, your, your, your live show because you're really, really good, mate. Well, thank you very much. That's very good of you. I've just done a podcast with a famous man tonight, so that will be appearing at some point. Lovely. It was his podcast, not mine. Uh huh. And it's not on in Talk Christmas either. No, no, that's right. But well, it says on the internet, it might, it, it might snow. The final love. I just love you doing the weather accent. You're fantastic. Did you like that? I love it. Right. I'll just I give you a quick boss, Martin. Here we go. Of course, looking ahead, so that takes us up to Christmas Eve. Christmas Day itself, there should be the odd flurry of snow, and uh, we're looking out for the odd rumble or two of thunder. So have the brollies handy, but uh, make sure you're ready to cover up the new Christmas jumper just in case it turns a little bit damp. Should be also a little bit cold, but, you know, at the height of the day, out for that Christmas walk. That's your weather. Wow, you are fantastic, mate. And um, I've um, sent you a wee um, personal message on your um, Facebook. Lovely. As well. well, a lot of these I might not get, Martin, because somebody had hacked it. Have it? Okay. Because yes, so don't sense. worry. If you don't hear back from me, don't take it personally. Okay, fine. Okay. Don't fine. think, because, is he um, no speaking to me or something? I know because um, I um, see you on Facebook now and then, active some, some, sometimes. Yes, yes, sometimes we're active, sometimes we're passive. Oh, uh -huh, cool. And um, basically, I've done, a, um, I've done a lot of take the high roads today. I've oh, lovely. Lovely. And, lovely. and look it. after Mrs. Mac and Dougal. Dougal passed away, somebody told me yesterday. No way. Yes. No way. Do, do, well, I think it was a wee while ago. I think it was in the spring. Uh -huh. And then uh -huh. Mrs. Mac passed away as well. Today, I've been, I've, been, I've, been, I've been watching all your past shows oh. um, on the laptop that, that I downloaded. I've seen them on the back when we discussed about Loch Lomond. Yes. And about all the Christmas markets. But maybe if, if we do meet up some, sometime, if you would do that, yes. and maybe show you how much I've done all the downloads. It's fantastic. fantastic. You can like jog your memory. If you can remember anything we've done, it's fantastic. Ah, uh, lovely, so, Martin. You take great care and dinky do la. Thank you, dear. Love you. Love you lots. Night, night, la, la. There we are. That's our Martin. Thank you, dear, everybody. Love you, sources, Keith. No, Keith, thank you so much. Hippo character applauds while nodding in approval, saying GG. That's another fiver, Keith, for goodness sake. There we are. You're great, says Keith. Keith, very, very much appreciated. What happens, Keith, is that money will go towards the next little bit of equipment. To enhance the phone in. We love it. Dinky do everybody to the telephones as quickly as possible. We have a lot to get through tonight, and of course, so little time to do it in. That's what it's about, I say. Um, it's your fault, Martin, that Santa is a fatty. No, it's not Martin's fault. Love you, love you lots, guys. Appreciate it. 65. I don't believe that for a minute, says Charlie. Charlie, you're a very, very kind man. McClue must have an IQ over 220. No, you're very good, Seanster, but 164 was the last measurement. An IQ of 164. I don't know how good that is. That COP26 was a farce. They all use private jets. Gavin, a private jet's going to use a lot less fuel than uh, uh, your local service. So there we are, then, then a commercial airliner. All the way from Sheffield, says Brett Dink. Do 
We love it, Brett. Dinky do to you, La. There we are. Brett Smith, fantastic. Give Scotty a talk show I'd watch. <laughs> there we are. Dinky do, Scotty. Good result for the Scottish Fitty team, Scotty. Yes, it did. There's John Boy from Port Glasgow. Dinky do, says everybody. Guys, I did you um, red eye this morning, an early bird. So look it up on the TikTok videos. Start watching them. I say to you, hello. Hello, Dinky Do. Lovely to have you with us. I say to you, how amazing is that? Would you like a boiled sweet before we land, Scotty? Andrew, if you don't mind, I'll have a barley sugar for my ears. That would be tremendous. Apparently, you don't put it in your ear. Don't try that at home, folks. That was for entertainment purposes only. So what about a barley sugar, Andrew? And then are we clear to land? Are we landing on runway 0303? And down you come in your own time. Thank you. Fantastic stuff. Welcome, my friend. Thank you, Keith. Uh, how are we doing, my good sir? Follow. James, fantastic. Thank you very much. Everybody's joining us tonight for the most amazing time. I love it. Who have we got here? You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hi, Scotty. It's my second call. Oh, my goodness. You're quick tonight, Glenn. Are you not watching the football? I am watching it. It's going to be tedious to be fair, Scotty. Just a wee second, Glenn. Are you going to a service on Sunday? No, Beachy, Beachy. We are the service on Sunday. So watch Scotty McClue, YouTube and TikTok from 1030. Yes. I, I was just thinking, Scotty, Alaska didn't used to be, uh, it used to be owned by Spanish, ex Spanish expeditions. The what, love? You know, Alaska, Scotty, part of... Uh, oh, Alaska, yes, yes, uh, yeah. yes, Alaska, yes, of course. Have you been? I haven't, no, Scotty. No, no, I haven't been by, to Alaska, no, no. It used to be owned by, according to the internet, uh, Salvador Fidalco. Is that right, Scotty? Uh, the what, la? Salvador Fidalco, Scotty, uh, took to San Carlos, to Alaska. You know when uh, they renamed it? Right, right. I'm not sure. You've lost me there, Glenn. You're miles yeah. ahead of me. I don't know really very much about Alaska, to be honest. The only, all I really know about it is a friend of mine used to serve yeah. up baked Alaska. Oh, yeah. And that's uh, hot ice cream inside cold meringue. There's, Sorry, there's cold of, ice cream inside hot meringue. But there's a lot of capital, a lot of uh, states that weren't owned by the... Uh, the country back in the day and this got there oh yes absolutely yeah. yes indeed hello to the other sheffield lot that was mentioned says gavin so yeah, he's saying he's know. saying hello to blades oh, to, to, to those who shall not be named scott well well i've just called them the blades you'll know what i mean the steel workers shall we just, just i've, I've just them. tipped thee the wink Hey, bye, go and all that. Hey, bye, go lad. You, you got, know. I've got no aminosity to our. Uh, of course not. Our, our idols, and of some course not. Do. Why would you, for goodness' sake? Some, some people do, and I'm thinking it can turn literally. It can turn out to be a, a you know, these banter pages on Facebook or whatever. Yes. Like the social media. It can turn personal, Scotty, sometimes, and it's it's really stupid, isn't it? Well, what about this for personal? I think this is rather lovely here. Uh, somebody's just put, hang on till I get it for you. Hello again, Glenn, says Ronnie Shaw. Keith Snedden says, love, Glenn. There, well. there we are. And Keith has sent another fiver. That must be three fivers he sent, Scotty McClue. Keith, what are you doing? Are you tapping the dollar at the bottom of the super chat? You're welcome, says Keith. Yeah. Isn't that beautiful? It's fantastic, Scotty. But rivalry and banter. Mitch is speak. asking, what does your hat represent? My hat represents Scotty McClure. It's a Glen Gary. When you're a banter and that banter should just be kept within its... Well, banter's the... banter. I mean, if you have a look, I uploaded a couple of TikToks today and it's just quality banter. Exactly, I like banter, but some people just don't like banter they're really stupid really there's jd saying well happed up tonight scotty isn't that lovely 
if, uh, if people don't like banter, don't give banter out any kind of thing. Mitch is asking, what's a Glen Gary? This is a Glen Gary, Mitch. All right. There Have you go. How many years have you been collecting the... Uh, your Scottish hats, then Scotty, all your life. Oh, all my life, love. I've got stacks yeah. of them. There's an absolute got... belter. I'll see if I've got it. Hang on a second. I've absolute belter, Glenn. I know you'd love it if I can find it. Now, I'll have to, uh, I'll have to have a look. I've shown you me, me Australian one. Ah, here we go. I wondered what happened to this. Right, Glenn, are you watching? I am. Yeah. Okay, here I go. I'm going to disappear for a minute. And I'm going to pop on this one. Do you remember that one? Isn't that beautiful? Do you like that? I don't yeah. Yeah, so there's a, a nice bit of tweed. And uh, we've got, uh, what else have we got? Hang on. I thought I'd lost this one. That's wonderful. Hang on. Tell me if you like this one. Do you like that one, love? I don't, Scotty. It's brilliant, that one. That's quite smart, isn't it? They look, they look like caps, though, in fairness. They're coming back, Scotty, to be fair, aren't they? Yeah, it's beautiful, isn't it? Now, of course they're coming back. They've never been away. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? And what about this? Hang on, Glenn. See what you think, love. There we are. Do you like me down under? That's a brilliant one, yeah. Isn't that beautiful? That's a proper jackaroo. Nice one. I think he even says it on it. Jackaroo. Mm. So that's for your sheep shearers out yeah. in Australia. Good eye, mate. So there we are. You're going to put a shrimp on the barbie, Scott. Isn't that beautiful? Scott, you're going to put Throw a shrimp, a shrimp on the barbie and we'll get that when we finish these sheep. And have a can of fosters. I think, I think that's can of, can of lager. We don't say the name. <laughs> yeah, we'll have a cool are. beer. We'll have a cool beer. You're ready to go into jungle, Scotty, with that. Isn't that beautiful? There's Keith saying, can I call you on Monday? Of course you can, Keith. Andrew says, remember to buy your advent calendar early, Scotty, this year. You couldn't get one for love nor money last year. Oh, well, because of the um, lockdown and everything. Yeah. There's, the advent calendars, there's all, there's all different types of them, Scotty, now, and they're just... They're just mind-boggling. I mean, back when they first came out, I, I, I don't know the exact years when they first came out. Well, you used to get a little bit of chocolate when you opened the door, you see. Yeah. So that's it. I think everybody's I saying, love the classic bonnet. Do you know where they originated from then, Scott, the Advent calendars? Oh, I thought you meant the, the Scotty McClue bonnets. Uh, Advent calendars. No, I don't know the actual background to them, Glenn. I'd love yeah. to find out. So it'll be some pre it'll be some Victorian time. Probably, oh yes, right? yes, yes. Well, you see, the Christmas cards were Prince Albert. How's that yeah. level? Shall I stick with that one just now? Yeah, that one's a good one. That one. It's also got a touch, a bit lighter than the jacket, but it's touch of the herringbone. That's the good old fashioned. Very nice. Uh, I think 19. Keith's just sent another fiver. Have you still got the glasses what you had on the badge then, Scott? Yeah, I've got them. Uh, you'll see them on one just the other day. Yeah. I don't think I've got them handy, but I've got to, I've got my mitts with me. Brilliant stuff. Yeah, I've got my mitts. Hang on a minute. I'll just show that. There you go, Glenn. Nice one. Scotty McClue's Hummel Duddy. It's all eating it. You can't beat it, can you, Scott? Yeah, you can't beat quality gear. Fantastic stuff. My granddad wore a bonnet and a pipe. That's better, yeah. says Charlie. There we I are. Mean, nothing's like you said, nothing's ever gone out of fashion. It's just of course it is. What's people's, it's just what people's preferences are, really. That's, well, I was just saying to somebody to. tonight, somebody had said, I'd asked a very senior guy in the radio industry, I said, if I came back on the radio tonight, would the audience come back? And he said, instant. Sweet, I mean, isn't it? What, what do you reckon to rip jeans, Sky? Rip jeans? I thought somebody had fallen. I didn't realize some poor soul came in and he was wearing them. I said, Oh, what the hell happened to you? Did you fall? Uh -huh. He goes, No, it's fashion. I said, All yeah, right, fashion, it's yeah. not fashion in our house, I'll tell you. 
There's Gavin saying, would you like a Prince Albert for an Xmas present? Now, a Prince Albert is a waistcoat chain. Yeah. For your watch. Very nice. Do you want Peaky Blinders and all that, Scotty? Peaky Blinders can't see a thing with them on. Yeah. Peaky Blinders. Wonderful. Yeah. You cheer me up. You're worth it, says Keith. He's so good, isn't he? Fantastic. It's good to Scott, to you, and it definitely is. It's what, Lovey? History is a good thing. Yeah. Oh, history. You can't beat it. You can't kind of. I beat. think they should cancel the football on a Friday night because Scotty McClure's on. The family all say hello, Scotty. Andrew, say hello to the family and send them love. One of the finest families in the world you're from. You're one of the luckiest <laughs> people in the world, and so are they. They could easily watch football on highlights of that. They live in a, a few girls. Yeah, they could put that on after McClure. They could say football will be on after 10 because you'll all be yeah. at internet phone in. Definitely. Do you think Macy Boy will come on? Uh, he might do, actually. Yes, we'll see yeah. if he comes on. Okay. Anyway, I'll have to dash, love. Scotty, I'll give Macy Boy my regards anyway. I hope he has a You're a very day. kind man, Glenn. You're very forgiving. I think that's it. You've taken the high ground there. You've got away, yeah. You've taken the Definitely. high ground, love. Definitely. You're right uh, up there with the best of them, dinky doola. And you are as well. Oh, bless you and love you. Love you, Sky. Dinky doola. Dinky doola, la. What a top man. Right, that's it. That's our Glenn. Absolutely amazing. Fantastic. We love it. There we are. To the telephones, guys, as soon as you possibly can. Lots to talk about, so little time to do it in. Hello, Scotty Sunshine. Dinky doo. Dinky doo says Popeye. The Sailor Man. Hello, old chap. Wonderful stuff. Now then, what's happening here? You're live with Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hello, Scotty. Hello, lovey. How are you? How are you? I'm beautiful. Scotty, what is your favourite film? My favourite film? I think it's probably Where Eagles Dare. No, I think Sound of Music. What is your um, favourite book? Favourite book? Uh, I'm just trying to think here. Jack House's book about Glasgow. What is your favourite music? Favourite music? Kenneth McKellar. Wow. My love is like a red, red rose. Nice. Because it's so beautiful. Have a listen. Put it into YouTube. Kenneth McKellar, My Love is Like a Red, Red Rose. Tell me what you think. What about that? How is your evening going? Fantastic. What do you think? I've been watching you on uh, Martin's um, laptop. Right. So you know how my evening's going, don't you? Yep. Going very, very well. And lovely to hear you. Love you, Scott, my man. This is me again. Um, speaking of that note, see your accent. Your accent's fantastic. Oh, Keith sent another fiver. That's about 25 coins. There's Keith. He sent another fiver. My goodness oh, me. Oh, it's, it says the pair of characters holding his belly and laughing out loud. He sent me another fiver. How he's doing it, though, he hasn't said. Alice says, I love Kenneth McKellar, the finest voice ever. Isn't that beautiful? Uh, Scott, 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 here's a question for you. Yes. Do you think you ever like to be this year's Star of Christmas? Sorry, say that again, Martin. Uh, would you ever like to be this year's Father Christmas? Like, like, like a nice white beard and a nice suit, delivering Christmas presents. Well, I might disappear around the end of November just to get everybody's bike sorted. <laughs> I'm taking on a new elf for elf and safety. Yes. So, um, how do you ever um, cycle the bike? Well, yes, very much so. I used to cycle all the time, Martin. Uh -huh. I had a rally New Yorker from Nottingham, from the rally company, and it was a gold mud guards, green frame, rally New Yorker. It had cost almost £20. The stand was an extra eight and six, and it had a Sturmy Archer three-speed gear and a Miller Dynamo for the lights. Uh -huh. 
Yeah, it's beautiful. And I used to cycle all the time. And then some little Ned stole it. But I've still got the number. This would be about maybe, oh, 55 years ago. But I've still got the number of the frame in case it turns up. So there you are. So I hope we're getting about that. And have you tried um, homemade table and homemade fudge? Oh, all the time. My mother used to make it all the time. So what did so what so what did your mum make you? She made us tablet. She made us fudge. She made a beautiful cream sponge with jam. Oh, oh what about what about what about um, a scone and jam? She made scones and jam. She made pancakes. Wow, I love pancakes. There we are, chap. You must be speaking for yourself. And I like gold, I like golden syrup and pancakes. Oh, stop now, Martin. You're making me hungry. I must go. Love you lots. Well, love you. Bye. Bye bye. Elise has just sent ten pounds. Pear character flying in the air with a red cape and a smile on his face. Elise. You naughty, naughty person. That's so good of you. Who's calling here? Who have we got calling? Hello? You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? <coughs> Mr. Nobody. Michael Dinky Doo. Michael's sending me beautiful TikToks on the TikTok. I thank you. Fantastic. Now, uh, thieves, the plague of a nation, Scotty, can't replace memories that get stolen. Absolutely tweaks. I wasted a good freezer the last time I made tablet. You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Ah! ah! There we are. Fantastic. The daft is super Scotty. Super Alice. Very, very kind of you. Dinky do. Love the fish cakes. Oh, you should smell my fish fingers. Fantastic. Beautiful. Captain Birdseye. Fantastic. Alice, that was so good of you. And a big dinky do. I say, I can't believe. Scotty, what's better? Chewing the fat or still game? They're both excellent. They're different, Michael. There we are. You're live in Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hey. Hey. There we are, somebody that can't speak, but nevertheless wants their voice to be heard. Well done, you. There we are. Thanks for sharing the lives, everybody. Everybody should be following Scotty McClure on TikTok. And can I ask all the TikTokers and all the YouTubers to subscribe and tap the bell on YouTube. I would like to finish tonight's show in about 18 minutes' time with three thousand subscribers to the youtube channel now come on folks if we can't do that what are we about you're live on scotty's phone in who's that hello scotty it's phil again phil lovely to hear from you dinky do hi well um i've just decided to get on because usually like the others get on twice yeah no no you can have two calls time. tonight phil you can have that yeah, but I, I want to, uh, I'm curious, like, Glenn and the rest of them, where did our matey boy might get on? So I don't want to take up too much of the time, just in case, you know. No, no, don't you worry. Matey boy can uh, can go and do one uh, compared with your good self. Do you know what I mean? We need matey boy to come on and apologize. All right. I was just wondering if you had a bit of time, but it, it doesn't matter if you don't, if you, have, if you could do a little... Um, a little go on the squeeze box. One on the, you'd like one on the squeeze box? Yeah, that'd be great at the end of the show or if you got time. Would you like my favourite hymn that I very often do or would you like a Scottish song? No, Scotty, do whatever your heart leads you to do. Well, you yeah. know, no, we like everybody loves the harmonies in the hymn. Yeah, go for it, Scotty. You know, they like that, so we might do that. Scotty, do you remember the two brothers from Sheffield that would phone up? They were from my school, says Gavin. Isn't that beautiful? Good night, says the wonderful Keith Ned. And Keith, good night. And thank you Scotty. for all your kindness. Scotty, I'm enjoying your show and I'll let somebody else try and go. Phil, you're forward. an absolute top man. Dinky do la la. Dinky do la la. Dinky do la la. Ta ra now. That's our Phil. 
Uh, good night. Thank you very much. Scotty, keep your fishy fingers away. Not at all. Keith sent a huge whack of money tonight. There we are. You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Ah! There we go. Fantastic. Isn't that lovely? The funny. Now, that poor soul can't actually speak English, but he can sort of go, whoa! Isn't that lovely? I say a tune in the box, says everybody. Thank you, Kelly Hall, for sending that tune. Thank you to the beautiful Elise for sending that huge amount of pennies. It will all just mean that everything will flow now. That's what I say. You're live on Scottish phone in. Who's that? Ah! Is it? I love your show, Scotty. Thank you, Michael O'Neill. Thank you. Kelly's sending Mars. You're live on Scottish phone in. Who's that? Oh, Jeff. Oh, Jeff. Absolutely. IQ of one, and he's just used it up. There we are. Fantastic. He's, uh, he's been asleep for 50 years, I think. Fantastic. Now then, I do apologize for Jeff. You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? You are a fan. A fantastic guy. I thank you very much. Very good of you. Just chilling in my room watching Scotty McClure and listening to Roy Orbison. Great combinations. Thank you very much. The big O and the big M. That's what we like. Dinky do. Fantastic. Can I call? Of course you can, Keith. Yes, give us a ring. Be fantastic to hear from you. And welcome. Welcome, welcome, I say to you. Down the Swanee with Jeff. Yes, we're just about. I'm just going to ban Jeff. Just give me a wee second. Hang on. And we'll get Jeff banned. No problem at all. You're live in Scottish fun in. Who's that? I said what? Hello? I see what? Can't hear you. No need for these insults. What Scott never is, motorbikes. But these are half-witted people you've got to remember. Very, very, very low IQ. I mean, Jeff has virtually zero IQ. Poor lad. So there you are. But he has to realize that you have to watch your language coming on here. Ban the bunions, doing the swanee. Yes, down the swanee with them. Scapa flow. Texas is consulted. How do I phone in? It's a CBS. CBS, you go to the YouTube channel. You'll see it on my TikTok bio. Guys, has anybody had a look at the TikTok videos? It's got the instruction for getting your notifications for the phone in. So let's get moving, I say. Doing the swanee, Suzanne, with these half-wits. They've gone. And what I'll do, I'll give Jeff a lifetime back. Yes, as the generations go on there, there appears to be more people with less IQ. Well, I think I blame the fact they're on their phones all the time. And they're not looking at stuff. We're guessing people's houses, says James. Correct. Leave Scotty alone. He's a good man. Absolutely, Jack. But don't you worry. These are people that wish they could have a conversation with me. Yes, and they can't. So they have to say something silly. Yes, absolutely. Hello from Edinburgh. We love you in Edinburgh. Dinky do, I say. Now then, to the telephones as quickly as possible. Keep the swanee well fed, says Chris. Chris, we will. Do not worry. It's tremendous. There we are. We love it. Quality chat. Guys, thank you for sending your gifts tonight. Call you on Saturday, says Keith. Okay, Keith. Uh, it won't let me phone in. Can you please tell me a good, sing me the goodbye song? It will let you phone in. On their phones watching you, McClue. Well, that's true. Hello from Massachusetts in the USA. And the lights all go out in Massachusetts. Bonjour de Jonquois à Quebec au Canada. Oui, je regrette, mais je ne parle pas français très vite. Si tu parles lentement, peut-être je comprends. Yeah, je m'appelle Scotty McClue. Je suis le professeur de français à la YouTube uh, et TikTok. Okay, Scotty McClue. Wonderful stuff. Friday night gowls. That's what they are. McClue abides as the world collides. Yes, indeed. Chris, what a beautiful thing to say. Hello, hello. God save the Queen. 
What did you think of Steven Gerrard leaving Rangers? Well, the man's got to move onwards and upwards. Congratulations to him. And very, very best wishes. Très bon français, Scotty. Ha ha. Michel, I thank you. CC, oui, oui. Fantastic. Lovely to have it now. Squeeze box. There we are. Are we ready for a tune on the squeeze box? What do we think, guys? Any more calls, Scotty lad? Plenty of calls. Hello again from Hamel Hampstead. Where are you in the UK? I'm up next month. I'm in Glasgow in the west of Scotland. Dinky do, I say. There's Dewey. Wonderful. Uh, are you Scottish or is your name Scotty? My name is Scotty and I'm very Scottish. Always ready, says Chris. Excellent. Everybody ready for a tune on the squeeze box? Come through it, says Big Nose. Absolutely big nose. Drop bums and bombs. The old school will know. Scotty for Prime Minister, says Jack W. Thank you, Jack W. Let's hear the music, Scotty. What part of Glasgow you face, Scotty? I'm in Gurak. I know Gurak very well. Ashton and the Clough, Kempock Street. Yes, indeed. The Pier Heed, Shore Street, Royal Street, John Street. Craig Mushet, we love it. Lots of love. Cardwell Road. Night all, says Keith. Night, night, Keith. Have a lovely day. I, I, I raise a drink of water to you, sir. Oh, we love it. Guys, I was on TikTok this morning at a quarter to seven. Your image should be on the pound sterling notes. I think so. I think it should actually, yes. I have to get down. Your phone lines are down, mate. No, they're not. My phone lines are never down. We can't have it. Right, phone lines are open, guys. If anybody needs to phone, let's hear from you, I say. That would be wonderful. There you are. Phone lines are open. There, I told you. You're live with Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Thank you. Phone lines are open. Isn't that beautiful? Hello? Hello. Hello, are you talking? Yes, I'm talking. Sorry, um, I'm getting a bit of up with you. You need to turn down the background. Yes, I do apologize. Not at all. No, no, no apology needed. We just need to hear you. Let me turn you off. Are you off? Yes, turn that off and come and talk to me on the phone. Very well. Who's that? It's Keith. Oh, Keith. Keith, I can't thank you enough for all your kindness tonight. Uh, don't worry about it. Oh, not a problem. That's wonderful yeah. that you got through on the phone. Yes, anything to help you. No, it's just so good of you. That will go towards little bits of equipment for the phone end. No, it's just so kind of you. Thank you so much. Keith, tell me, share your secret. How are you sending it? Are you tapping the dollar sign? Yes, then you just go into it and it's either like a £5, £10, £20. Oh. Like £5 at a time. So I didn't half. That was just so <laughs> kind of you. Well, to be honest with you, I hope, I hope it always... It's, um, you're going to be good for that because I know it's like £5 at a time, £20. £20 it's £20, huge. It's absolutely oh, huge. It's a, it's a king's ransom, Keith. Oh, really? <laughs> it's just wonderful. Thank you so much. Listen, it's not a problem. And the beautiful Alice in the north of England sent a tenor as well. You see, once yeah. one person yeah. starts, everybody yeah. starts. Yeah. <laughs> it's dinky do, I, I say. It's but lovely. Yeah, that, but, but listen, like I would feel like um, everything helps. Of course it does, but it's just everything so kind. Helps. It's the kindness. And the TikTokers yeah, are so beautiful. The thing is, um, because I miss you so much um, from Scott FM. Oh, that so was... Then, you know, 
Um, well, we've got it there now, but we're talking to radio people all the time. Yeah, I understand that, yes. You know, because somebody said to me, Scotty, we need to get you back on the radio, son. Precisely. You know, the why people can, why, the people why, are why, wanting why, it. Yeah, but why can't you do that? Well, it's just because the managements are a bit slow off the mark there. They tend to be what you call risk averse. So you've got some wee guy that struggled all his life. He's no good on the radio, but he's become a manager. And somebody says, why don't you take Scotty McClure? He goes, oh, heavens, no. No, that would bring us a huge audience, and I couldn't cope with that. <laughs> I see. But it's, it's terrible, so, uh, because you are, oh, so you, honestly, you're uh, Absolutely brilliant. Oh, you're a lovely man. You're a lovely man, Keith. Do you remember the big Scott FM shows? I do, I do. I actually phoned you that time, didn't you? you yes. Know, like, five people smelt and the rest of it. all that stuff, and you came on and you yeah, did your stuff. All that stuff yeah. And you were going to tell me, Keith, about the uh, the garden of diesels. The what, sorry? The garden of diesel in the Leyland Arab. I remember we talked about the Leyland Arab. Oh, right, 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 right. Uh, right, right about the buses. The yeah. buses, the yeah. Gardner Diesel, yeah. the Gardner. Yes, yes, yes. Do you mind I told you a boy from Edinburgh phoned me and he says the Gardner did 25 mile an hour down the hill right. and 25 right. mile an hour up the hill. Well, that's right, because that was starting to be a little bit. It used to be that it was, it was, um, it wasn't all them buses, it was the council. The council, that's right. Uh, and Keith. Yeah, it was the council at the time. That's right. And and there were wonderful, beautiful, clean buses. And do you remember um, the way the gardener chattered? She used to sit at the stop going, boom, 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 boom. boom. That's right, yes, yes. Lovely yes, thing. Yes. Correct. And that, see when that, Winston but, Churchill died, Keith, yes. they had a launch, she's still on the Thames, called the Haven Goer. She belonged to the Port of London Authority, and oh, she was built at Tufts of Teddington oh. in 1956. And they took Winston Churchill's coffin up the river, yes, uh, Tower Bridge up to Waterloo, I think it was, um, on the back of the Haven Goer. Yes, and the Haven Goer, Richard Burton, was doing the commentary for ITV. And a dear old friend of mine that worked at Border Television recorded that for me. And what is wonderful, at the time when Burton's commenting and he says, and as they take the body of the great man, you know, I can hear boom, 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 boom. Because the Haven Goer... Had two eight cylinder <laughs> gardeners in her. Right. Isn't that lovely? That was brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. So there's a wee story for you. Yeah, I know, I know, but I've got a few stories for you. I'll bet you have. Keith, I'm going to have to dash, lad. We're out of time. Yes, I understand that. Look I'm after your problem. dear self and thank you again. No problem. That's. Just yeah. so good of you, sir. And we will catch up again for more quality yeah, chat. Yes, we will do. Thank you. Dinky doo, Keith. Thank yeah. you. What a nice yeah, man. Boy. Bye bye, la. There we are. What an absolute cracker of a gent, our Keith. That's him. So there we go, guys. And uh, Keith uh, dro driving the old buses. There we are. My dad drove the trams and buses for Glasgow Corporation and later he drove for McGill's. Charlie Johnson says the 6LXB Scotty had them a lot of the fishing boats in the 1960s. Well, I think this would be an 8LXB. Guys, what a beautiful night tonight. I'm going to have to dash. Tomorrow night, 9 o'clock sharp. Ta-da-la! <laughs>